Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today I got up rather early and then I'm tired when it's time for the videos because I really should take a nap and I don't take naps. If I took a nap I would not wake up until probably three o'clock in the morning or something like that and then I'd have to make my video. Maybe that would be the hour to make it. I don't think so. Well, today I called the lawyer. I know you don't think so either. <laughs> He's shaking his head. <laughs> He's agreeing with it. Um, today I called the lawyer's office again. I've had to call the lawyer Friday. I've called them Monday. Now today is Tuesday and I called again. Because according to the realtor, and from what I can gather... The other people have had their money at the, their lawyer's office for two weeks. And my lawyer had some note on the thing that, to hold off because they were waiting for, I guess, the money to be gotten through the bank or something. So I called my realtor to find out what's going on. And he said, no, they've got the money at the lawyer's for the last two weeks. So I've been trying to get a hold of my lawyer. And each time... They say he's extremely busy. Yes, he is extremely busy. And he's doing house closings. And I said, that's what I'm calling about. I need to get this house closing done. So I called Friday, Monday. Actually, Monday twice. Because mm -hmm. I called early 9 o'clock in the morning. And then I waited for him to call me back. Because they said he would probably call me back. Well, he never did. So then I called at 1 o'clock. And he still hadn't. And he was very busy. And then I called today, and the guy that I usually talk with was off, and some lady answered the phone. Boy, she wasn't as nice. I'll tell you that right there. But I still needed to know that he, I want him to know that I'm calling. So, and the, the guy said, Matt said, that the squeaky wheel will get the, get the action. So I guess I'm going to be a squeaky wheel and keep calling. Then I called the village office because I wanted to know what I can do about the water situation over there because I could have the electric turned off, but I can't really have the electric turned off because it's the blue bugger, blue bugger time. So they can't turn off any utilities. And um, he said something about the water. They could just transfer it over into the new person's name and not not have to turn it off actually because I do have a tenant in there and he needs the water and so they're they're going to um, give me the paperwork that I'll need to take with me when I go to the lawyers to have them signed so that I can say this is the name of the people that are going to be taking over the water thing and they're gonna have to go down there and they're gonna have to apply too because um, I will have what what they said they would do. I know it's, it's it's such a mess right now. What they said they would do is the date that I say that I'm done being owning of the house. They will consider that my last day. They'll take the last reading of the water and the last reading of the electric, but everything will stay going, and the new people will get the bill from then on when they finally sign up for it or put their name on it so that the bill can go to them. But uh, as far as I'm concerned, I'm done at a certain date. When I get the lawyer papers so, um, signed, which they haven't been signed, because St. Joseph wants to come out of the dirt, and I won't take him out until he, I, the actual final papers have been signed. <laughs> I could have taken him out when they told me the house was sold, but I, I've waited. I want to take him out when... I sign the final papers and then I can go to the insurance company and have the insurance canceled off the house because I have fire insurance on the house. So there would be a lot that I've got to do yet, but I'm still waiting for the lawyer. Mm -hmm. Always waiting for somebody. That's crazy. We can't have the electric turned off in empty apartments. They're empty, yes. And I can't have them turned this... off. Blue bo booger. Yeah. The blue booger is gotcha. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So that's, and I took, I took, um, Mr. Brown, I had to think, what did I call him? Mr. Brown, my, my little guy. I took him outside 
with the chickens and they were around a little bit but they still didn't bother with him and one of and Blackie actually looked like she was going to go for him again so I kind of stood in front and she snapped at my shoe <laughs> instead so she was telling me hey I don't like you in here either so I guess we're not welcome <laughs> I don't know so then later on I had him walk around in the kitchen again and then I took him out on the porch and he did that and then I took him out in the grass and he was scratching around and he was having a he was he was enjoying the outdoors and now he's resting right next to his little teddy bear that looks like a rabbit because it's it's a bear wrapped up it's a bear in a rabbit's costume and he seems to find comfort sleeping next to that so that's where he was just a few minutes ago when I came out so that is my video waiting and waiting for the legal department to do their thing so I can do my thing and until then let's hope I hear something by I hope soon I, think I would like to say by tomorrow but I have a feeling I'm going to be playing um, the person Little that's tag. I'm going to be well I'm going to be the bugging I'm going to be the squeaky wheel for a while so until the wheel gets greased it's going to squeak and that's me so I'll see you tomorrow bye bye Thank you.